could be good for me. Hey guys, it's your girl Belinda. What's up? <laughs> so today I'm doing that delicious seafood. Okay, just got in a 25 minute workout, hard cardio on my gold gym machine. All right, guys. So let's check out all my things that I have prepped up in the kitchen. Um, so it's nice and comfortable outside today. So that's good. All right, let me grab my drink. All right, so. And let's see what I got going on over here. Okay. Woo. So it was good to get that workout in, y'all. Can't express that enough. All right. So I'm doing a seafood platter deliciousness. So I'm going to do a flip side so you guys can check it out. Okay, guys. So here I have the lovely a lobster tails. Look at that. Yummy, yummy, yummy. All right. So beautiful, so clean. Giants. All right. Whenever I get seafood, I like to get it either at the Giants or Wise in my area. I have the shells over here. Those are going in the mini, micro, mini uh, oven. Excuse me. I have Brussels sprouts that I'm mixing with my scallops. And I have my delicious shrimp. And these bad boys are big and they're easy peel so good um, I got a, a better brand uh, than usual so I went a little bit over with these guys um, I have some jalapeno pepper padu uh, Yancey's fancy New York style right there okay so this is gonna be a little shred that I'm gonna I'm gonna do on top of my uh, scallops and my uh, Brussels sprouts all right the seasonings that I'm using today is going to be the same thing I used yesterday on that delicious uh, spaghetti. This is uh, Chef Paul again, magic seasoning blend, but this is a seafood magic. Okay, I like his blends. Ginger, sofrito. I have a California avocado over here as well. And I have Amish country roll butter, okay? So that's the butter I am using for everything. I have a yellow cooking onion as well. Um, so, I um, so um, there we have it. I am gonna get in the shower. I'm gonna get some stuff. In, I'm gonna get some stuff in the oven. Stuff uh, shells here, and then I'm gonna work on the rest of the stuff while it's soaking and clean spring water. So there you have it. Look at those bad boys. Scallops are, these are really big scallops. Brussels sprouts, I can't express how delicious those are with some Amish butter. Mm -mm -mm. So these are my simple ingredients that I'm using. And for a little bit of presentation on top, I'm going to use a little bit of the spring onion little house, okay? So it's already ready and I like that. Nice and a little bottle, fresh to go on top. So there you have it. I have some deliveries I have to do today and I am going to get this done. So I will catch you guys after my shower. Okay guys, this is a Florida, Florida avocado. I did say California, uh, so my bet on that, it's a Florida avocado. So I just wanna make sure I said everything correctly in my video. All right, there you have it. Uh, Brussels spots are completely uh, nice and soft to the touch. Um, so now we can go ahead and throw in our onions, our scallops. And again, look at those babies floating in that simple ginger, that Chef Paul uh, seafood magic. So good, and a little bit of that Amish butter. All right, so let's start throwing our scallops in there. This is gonna be a Brussels sprout mixed with the scallops. So good. And seafood cooks so 
so quickly and you gotta get it out while it's hot. That's how I like to have, make sure I get everything out fresh. All you seafood lovers, yummy, yummy, yummy. Brussels spots to the top, to the tippy top, let the scallops be the bedding while it cooks. Be careful with the Brussels spots, that way they stay intact, like those little beautiful balls that they are. All right, guys, and all we're gonna add in here is a little bit of sofrito, very teeny. We're gonna only do a half a tablespoon of that. Just let it rock out right in the bottom. Just mix it in the bottom, it'll be fine. And also, don't forget that magic, what's that called magic again? The same thing I use into the lobster tails is the same ingredients I use over here, except I add in those lovely onions. And uh, I don't add in the ginger though, not the ginger. All right, there you have it. All right, those stuffed crabs should be ready to go. I'm gonna bust this open. Once this starts cooking, I'm gonna throw the in there. Okay, but I'm gonna let the scallops cook a little bit before I throw them in. And here are those bad boys go. Look at that. Delicious. Here, girl. Your girl.